If asked, what would we say has been the greatest thing to ever happen to us? What has been the most significant event in our lives? One of my favorite prayers is simply any time I enter a Catholic church and at the entrances we find the holy water and it's always the reminder of this most definitive event and moment where we went from one world and stepped into a whole new world. And I dip my fingers in the holy water. It's probably we all do. And make that sign of the cross. Come to say these words. Happy the man whose sin is forgiven. It's really a joyous and happy event every time we step into church. And we're greeted there, you know, reminded and dipping our fingers in. Happy the man whose sin has been forgiven. We hear a way of expressing that from St. Paul. Speaking of our Lord who saved us through the bath of rebirth and renewal by the Holy Spirit. When and where did that take place for us, our baptism? I always uh, recall this weekend, uh, the baptism of the Lord. This is the weekend in which I was uh, baptized. Uh, St. Mary of the Lake, although they were in a um, reconstruction project, uh, so I was baptized in the gymnasium. <laughs> but wherever that may be, for us to recall what occurred and how major of an event, and in fact, we need to say the most significant event of all of our lives the day of our baptism. Perhaps uh, a fair many of us that was right in this place, this church, this house of God. What is it that we received at our baptism? Uh, what took place? We see it manifested in this scene The first thing that occurs is the sin in which I entered this world with is completely washed out. So sin out. But then also someone came within us. And that someone is God himself. Sin out and God in to something we could profoundly reflect on each and every day. And we've become a holy temple of God through our baptism. And then finally, and this is what I so much have been grateful for and reflecting on uh, in past years, and especially as a priest. So sin out, God in. And we are born into a new family. Into God's holy family. The family of the church. And like to celebrate the family in which I've been born into. By sheer gift. I think to be able to know I can call God Father. 
because indeed he is father. And I'm his child. He's made me his child. To be able to say, even dad, on that day, that occasion, I received God as my dad. One in whom I can entrust my life. So a beautiful gift on this weekend of the baptism of the Lord. For us to uh, have that gratitude. Uh, and perhaps as we uh, go forth today, leaving the church, dipping our fingers in that holy water, uh, to make a sincere prayer uh, to our God, uh, remembering that the greatest day.